and we have made our way to the Queen Anne's County Fair. There's so much to see and do the six best days of the summer, but when it comes down to it, the fair is all about the kids. And to start this off, I found two of my three leaguer boys. And what is your name? Connor. Connor. And who do we have next to us? Adam Lear. And what is your name? Kaylee. How are you today? Good, how are you guys? Good, and what is your name? <laughs> Brislyn Sweeney. Hi, my name is Casey Turner. So what is your name? Bridget. Bridget. Can you tell me your name? Andrew. Andrew, and Andrew, what's your friend's name here? Which one? The goat. Dancer. And you have another friend here. What is your name, sir? Billy. Caught in the act, but we woke him up. How are you today, sir? Good. Good. Tell me your name. Mason Hanzo. Mason Hanzo. And what is your name? Hunter. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good. And what is your name? My name is Malin Rhodes, and I'm the 2019 Miss Queen Anne's County Farm Bureau. How are you today? Good. Good. And what is your name? Anna. Anna. And tell us who your friend is here. His name's Levi. Like the jeans. Like the jeans. All right. And I'm here with some friends. How are you? Good. What is your name? Lexi Kern. I like uh, showing my duck and walking the goats. Walking the goats. So you guys have been hanging out in the goat barn all week. Yeah. Yes. And what kind of goat is this? This is a Nigerian dwarf. Nigerian dwarf. Who is our friend here? This is Noah. Noah. And what kind of breed horse is Noah? He is a Chincoteague pony. Really? Wow. So tell us, um, you and Noah have been competing all week. What are some of the classes you've competed in? Um, we competed in the English flat class classes, the Western regular flat classes, and fitting and showing, and then we did Nez Pierce Thursday. So tell us, what did you guys compete in this week? We competed in some English classes, like just groundwork, and we did some racing classes, like barrels or poles. Last night, we did Nez Pierce, oh, which yeah. is pole racing, and that's about all we competed in so far this week. And all week, what is one of your favorite things that you got to compete in? Probably Nez Pierce. Nez Pierce. So if someone doesn't know about that, what is that? It's where you put two sets of poles in the arena and you race against each other and so you can get back the fastest. Nice. And is Levi pretty quick? Yes. <laughs> He's pretty quick. All week, what are one of your favorite classes to compete in with Noah? Definitely Nez Pierce, because he has the most fun with it, and it's just so fun to just be able to race other people. And Breezlin, tell us your friend behind us. This is Suppressa. She is 12 years old. 12 years old? Wow. So is that old for a llama? Not really. They live till 20 to 25 years old. Really? Wow. And everyone always says that llamas spit. Is that true? They do. If you pet them on their heads, they will spit at you. Um, so that's the key. Don't pet them on their heads. And don't feed any of our llamas, please, because the other ones will get jealous and they might end up spitting at you. So it's like a mean thing. Like if you do something mean or, you yes. know, that's where they get that spitting thing. And when their ears are back like she is, she is not happy. Gotcha. <laughs> so th that's when they're nervous, kind of stand back. Yes. So and tell us a tip about a llama that someone might not know. Um, llamas have two toes. Two toes? Yeah. Really? <laughs> I do. did not know that. It's right down. They do. Look at that. <laughs> and behind me, you have a beef project. What is your cow's name? Diesel. Diesel. And how much does Diesel weigh? 12, 1,250 pounds. So he's a big boy. Yeah. Nice. And you've been showing him all week long. Yeah. You've been doing well. I see. You got some ribbons. Yeah. So Bridget, how many sheep have the king brought this year? Uh, we have uh, 15. 15 sheep. Wow. So tell us a little bit about your sheep. What are the breeds you guys show? Uh, we show a cross breed between Suffolk and Hampshire, so they're a meat breed. Meat breed, okay. Gotcha. And how many showed this year? How many kings were there? Uh, five, including me. Five, including you. Wow. Wow. Amazing family. And Kaylee, tell me a little bit about your pig project. How we many have pigs do you have? 11. 11 pigs. 12. 12. And what are, do you know some of their names? Um, Meg Red, Lola, Pepper, Hambyton, and Jax. Nice. The w pigs that I really like is that Big Red right here, and um, she she's the best one that we have here. That my cousin Ethan right there, he's um, that's his pig, and 
We have a lot on um, the show. The show, we've had wonderful weather. Yes, we have, a beautiful week. So, but our week is coming to an end, but tell us you're gonna go on to Maryland State. Yes, ma'am, I will go on to compete for the title of Miss Maryland Agriculture, um, August 21st and 22nd. The 21st, I'll go over to the State Fair for an interview, and then the 22nd, I will go and do round table discussion, and in the evening around six o'clock, I'll go for an actual um, contest where they ask me a fishbowl question. I would also like to invite everyone to tune in and watch me as I compete um, underneath the Maryland Farm Bureau Facebook page as they stream a live feed. Milk, it does a body good. We made our way to the dairy cow barn. And Lexi, who's the friend here between us? Her name is Clementine. Clementine, that's a cute name. Good, so tell me something that someone might not know about a dairy cow, maybe a tip or something. Okay, well, they're not exactly like beef. They are built with for milk. They're not built for body, so they're not going to be as big as you if you walk in the beef barn. Very good. So that's a good tip for someone that's never been to the fair. So we couldn't re forget visiting the Queen Anne's County Fair without the FFA stand. And I'm here with Leslie Moore. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good. So tell us, how long has FFA been making snowballs? For about 30 years. So you guys have been at the fair for a long time. Yes, we have. It's, it's a great for our chapter, great for money, yes. And tell us, Leslie, what is the number one flavor at the Queen Anne's County Fair? Cotton candy. Cotton candy, every kid's gotta have it. No fluff about it. This barn is overlooked, but so much work goes into the rabbit and poultry barn. These kids put so much time and effort into them. You can see here, Trey Palmateri's fluffy bunny is laying down for the rest as we come to the end week of the fair. All week long, Connor, what is one of your favorite things you like to do at the Queen Anne's County Fair? I like to show my steer. Show your steer? Yeah, that's a lot of work goes into it, but you get those ribbons, it's so exciting. And tell us, what is one of your favorite things about the fair? Um, showing animals and just getting time to be with them. Be with the animals. And you've been here all week. What is one of your favorite things at the Queen Anne's County Fair? Riding the rides. You like the rides? Yeah. So you enjoy showing your animals, but you like the rides? Yeah. What is one of your favorite things to do at the fair? Um, I like to hang out with friends, show animals, and ride rides. There you go. So you got it all in one week. My favorite is everything that we do here to help people and do a lot of stuff. The whole fair? Yeah. And what was one of your favorite things about the fair? Um, definitely showing my sheep. Showing your sheep. One thing that you love at the fair? I love going to get the good ice cream at the ice cream booth. Ah, me, that's my vote too. What's your favorite flavor this year? Cappuccino Crunch. Cappuccino Crunch. See, milk. It does a body good. Tell me, what is one of your favorite things to do at the fair? Um, I love to show off the llamas to people that don't know anything about them or people that have never seen them in their whole life. Well, I personally love the llamas. I think they're a pretty cool animal. And thanks for showing us your llamas. You're welcome. And I hope you enjoyed the kids' view of this year's fair.